efforts by these banks to extricate themselves from financial difficulty have not borne fruit. The situation has rather worsened for these banks. Unibank and Royal Bank were identified during the AQR update exercise in 2016 to be significantly undercapitalized. The two banks subsequently submitted capital restoration plans to the Bank of Ghana. These plans, however, yielded no success in returning the banks to solvency and compliance with prudential requirements. The official administrator appointed for Unibank in March 2018 has found that the bank is beyond rehabilitation. Shareholders, related and connected parties had taken amounts totaling 3.7 billion CDs, which were neither granted through the normal credit delivery process, nor reported as part of the bank's loan portfolio. In addition, amounts totaling 1.6 billion had been granted to shareholders, related and connected parties in the form of loans and advances without due process and in breach of relevant provisions of Act 930. Altogether, shareholders, related and connected parties of Unibank had taken out an amount of 5.3 billion CDs, constituting 75% of total assets of the bank.